guys I'm Afton and welcome to my channel um, in today's video I will be showing you guys how to make a Guinness fish cake all right I'm gonna show you guys step by step how to make this delicious meal and I hope you guys enjoy watching my video give my video a thumbs up and please subscribe to my channel and click the bell so you guys will be notified whenever I upload another video all right and if you're new to my channel every day in October I will be uploading a video for you guys all right and today is Diwali so I'd like to ask you guys to go and watch all of my Diwali sweets that I made previously I made some Mai Tai I made Parasat I made sweet rice and I make some Oops, oh, oh Mai Tai all right so you guys can go check those videos out I'll put I'll leave them I leave the link in the description box down below all right so let me just show you my ingredients for my guys fish cake enjoy hey guys here are some of my ingredients for my fish cake so first we have some potato here I have to boil the potato then we have some onion garlic shallow celery and weary pepper I'm gonna blend this in my food processor and we have our fish here we're just gonna put this to boil for about five minutes so in this pot here we're gonna put the potato here to boil till it gets soft and in this pot here we're gonna put in our fish all right just to let it boil for about five minutes Then I'm going to put all my onion, garlic, shallot, celery, everything in the food processor and let it blend up. All right. We'll be back. Okay, so everything's in the food processor, so we're going to blend it up now. We'll be back. Okay, so my seasoning is well blend up here. I'm just gonna put it into this container here. I just turn off this stove with my fish. So we'll be back. Okay, so I just took the fish out of the pot. So what you can do, if you want, this is optional. You could peel off the skin of the fish that's if you want I'm just gonna peel off some of the skin not all of it all right we'll be back okay so then you're gonna just break your fish up into pieces but I want my own to be really really fine so I'm gonna put my fish in the food processor so I'm gonna pour it into the food processor and let Fine, fine, fine. Oops. We'll be back. So I'm gonna blend up my fish now. Okay. Fine, fine, fine. We'll be back. Okay, so my fish finish blending up here. So here we go. So as soon as my potato finish boiling, I'll show you guys the next step. We'll be back. Okay, so my potato finished boiling. I'm gonna put it, take it out and put it into this bowl. Okay, so I'm gonna um, mash up my potato while it's hot, so it can be a little easier, all right? So as soon as the potato finished boiling, mash it up quickly, all right? So we'll be back. Okay guys, so my potato finish um, mashing up. So what you're gonna do now, you're gonna put in the fish who I blend up earlier in the food processor. So you're gonna put in your fish. All right, and then you're gonna mix this up. So my fish and potato finish um, mixed up together. So you're going to do the season that you blend up earlier. You're going to put in some of it. 
I'm gonna mix it up. So you mix up your season with the fish and the potato. We'll be back. Okay, so we're gonna put in our other seasoning now to give it some flavor. So we're gonna put in some uh, purple seasoning. We're gonna put in some fish seasoning. We're gonna put in some ginger powder. Put in some paprika. Paprika. Some mustard hot sauce. A little bit of chili pepper. And then you're gonna mix everything together. All right. You're supposed to also put in an egg, right? But I just break two eggs and both eggs. It's in good, so. But you guys can put egg in it, all right? But I don't have any egg right now because the two I just break, it's it in good, so. I'm gonna have to fry this now without the egg, all right? So, let me continue mixing this up, so we'll be back. Okay guys, so you're gonna um, put some flour in your hands, like this, oops, and then you're gonna roll out your fish cake. You can put whatever, um, whatever size you want to put it, you could do it wrong, you could do it whatever shape you want. I'm gonna put mine like this, I'm put it in my thing like this, whatever shape you want, alright? And just keep rolling them out. I already put on my fire. I really wish I had my eggs. Oh my gosh. So it would be more crispy and nice, but it's okay. Alright, so we'll be back. So I finished rolling out four. So we're gonna do we're gonna take each of them and put it into the flour like this. put them into the flour and then you're gonna put them to fry all right so I'm, I have my oil on there so I'm gonna put them to fry now I'm gonna put two at a time all right so let it fry until they get brown and then you're gonna take it out so you'll be back Okay guys, so I'm taking it out of the oil. So wait till the rest finish frying. So we'll be back with the end results. Okay guys, so this is the end results for my Guinness fish cake. Here we go. This is just five of them came out okay and the rest kind of get loosey loosey because I didn't have because I didn't put any egg, all right? I did have egg, but because it didn't wasn't good, I couldn't use the egg in it, right? So you guys, please make sure that you put egg inside of it because the egg is going to hold it better, all right? The egg, the, the egg is going to keep it together. All right, so I hope you guys enjoy watching my video. Give my video a thumbs up. And please subscribe to my channel. Click the bell so you guys will be notified whenever I upload the video. This fish cake, you can eat it with anything. You can eat it with um, puri and you can put some sour on it. Oh my God, that's so delicious. Or like for my son, he wants dollar rice with the fish cake. So that's what I'm doing today. I just make my doll and my rice. But I already have a um, video with my doll. So if you guys would like, I will leave that in the description box down below. All right. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I think today is October day 22. Yeah, I think it's 22. All right. So you guys come back tomorrow as well to get a video as well. So thank you guys so much for watching and stay blessed.
拜。